What is going on, YouTube? My name is Ty for the King. Back with another video. Terry, we're talking about Spy T, one of my favorites. What shouldn't be my plan for Spy T? I think, um, well, I'm not giving financial advice, but one year, what I'm showing my, uh, what is down, uh, year to date. So, three months, it is down 0.85%. And that 0.85% is because they pay dividends. Um, but this one stays at $19, $20. And I like it. I got three shares. And I like it because they're paying a dividend of $0.33, $0.32 cents a share, which is pretty nice. Now, in contrast with this um, stock here, East Spy T, SVOL is a little bit more. SVOL is a fan favorite. But I only got 50, half a share, um, and Esvol is paying 30 cents, right? And it's 22 dollars, and Spy T is 20 dollars, paying 33 cents. So it's about two dollars cheaper, and the dividend is like two, three cents more. So it's one of the things where should I sell Esvol for Spy T, put that money in Spy T? I'm thinking about doing that. I'm thinking I'm gonna buy more of this. I think this this could be. In my personal opinion, I'm not getting financial advice. I think it's one of the funds where it pay a dividend, and it's going to like, you know, here's you know, here's a no. See, it drop here. It was a three twenty to forty, and then drop here. That's a dividend coming out, and it stays there. It went down as low as uh, eleven uh, nineteen eleven, and it's back up to nineteen eighty two. So it's I think it's one of the they give you twenty percent yield. Solid yield again. If not paying more than ten percent yields, I probably won't look your way, right? I mean, at, the, at this point in time, you're not paying at least ten percent. Like Mr. Cow paying five, you're paying for forty eight dollars. It's not worth be having anymore. If you're not paying ten percent, um, you know, it's not worth my while um, anymore. Um, but a yield they target, they target for a twenty percent yield. Uh, for this ETF, so I'm thinking I'm thinking about well, this might be more like a retirement type of thing. I think it's be a really good ETF to have. I think you could just use dividends as much as you want because the price price stay the same. The dividend is be stable, but nothing's perfect or nothing's hands off, you know. So um, I'm gonna add more to this. I'm gonna try to get to 100 shares. That'll be thirty three dollars, thirty four dollars a month. And roll that every month, but my goal is like the hundred shares, and you do one share at a time. Um, but um, they try to target twenty percent, but my average cost is up. It's nineteen eighty eight, and it's nineteen eighty two now. You know, so I'm going down eighteen cents. But I'll take that. It's gonna pay me a dividend every month. But uh, what are your thoughts on Spy T? It's one of my favorite uh, ETFs because it's stable. I think it's one of the ones that you get, say, it pay you $1,000 per month. I think it's going to pay you $1,000 per month and the price stay the same. I don't know. It isn't set in stone, but I think it's going to hold that as NAV better than other ETFs out there. But what are your thoughts? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching.